Two questions. Sorry. Uh, one thing is, are you quite sure that the, um, the trans nuclear excitation is occurring with that uh, biology system? I mean, you just see the real trans energy or uh, X rays or something. And uh, the other one is, if you try to do this uh, de excitation process for D plus D, to make a heading for intermediate stage, that's a different things may happen because that stage you have a lots of decay channel from P plus T and then you have N plus heading three channel. The the two questions are are related. Um, a weakness of the uh, Fleischmann Pons experiment is because there's no energetic nuclear radiation. We're, we're blind about the microscopic uh, reaction. In my models, the DD going to helium-4 is going to ground state helium-4 with the 24 MeV quantum being split up into vibrations. Uh, so the, the whole point of, the, of our experiment and of the interpretation of Carboot, my interpretation, which Vysotsky doesn't like, of Cornelia Vysotsky experiment is that if you can demonstrate up conversion to a nuclear state on a lab bench, you can do it reproducibly. Then you have, you can take your leisure to investigate it, to ask as many questions as you like, to try different transitions, to measure the time response, to measure everything there is to measure. So at, at the end of that uh, series of experiments, you'll be 100% sure either it works that way or it doesn't.